and welcome back to my channel. So I am so excited to film this video for you guys today. I hope it's okay that this is kind of a fun video and it's not really animal or pet related. So as some of you may know, I am subscribed to the Nick Box, which is a box dedicated to 90s Nickelodeon. It is a subscription service box that you pay for monthly and this video is not sponsored in any way, shape or form, but I am personally subscribed to the Nick Box. It only comes out about once every three months. So it's not too bad, but the box is always huge and there are always tons of 90s Nickelodeon goodies inside. So I'm really excited to get into this box today. As some of you may remember, I posted a video a few months back called Nick Box Unboxing. I asked on that video if you guys would be interested in seeing another Nick Box Unboxing whenever I got my next box and you guys said you would. So I hope it's okay. I thought it would be fun to film this video for you guys since I just got my new box for this month. Here is the Nick Box for this month. It is a large cardboard box, the same size that it always comes in. But what I love about these boxes is, as you can see, it has this adorable artwork on the front. We have some SpongeBob here. We also have Hey Arnold and other little characters. And of course, and as you can see, it is a really cool boom box theme. Every time that I'm expecting a box, I get so excited because they put the absolute best stuff inside of here. I think they put a lot of effort into it. If you're interested in subscribing to the Nick Box, I will leave a link in the description down below. This video is not sponsored in any way, shape, or form. I just love Nickelodeon. I love 90s Nickelodeon. And so whenever I found that they were doing a subscription box, I had to have it. Okay, so I haven't opened this yet. I'm really excited. I have no idea what is in here. I didn't see any spoilers or anything. So let's open the box. Okay, so here is the box. As you can see, it is that really fun 90s boom box look. So let's get inside. Oh my goodness, are you guys seeing this? So the first thing that is always in here is the Nick Box postcard, which tells you everything that's in the box, but we obviously don't want to look at that yet because we don't want to spoil what's in here. Okay, so the first thing that I see is obviously a t-shirt. Let's see what's on it. It is by the Nickelodeon brand, very appropriate. Okay, super cute. So we have a little Nickelodeon t-shirt character here. Now, whenever you sign up for the Nick Box, you do pick what size you are. So this is gonna fit me because it is a small. That is the size box that I get. I will show you guys this standing up. So the next thing that I see right away is this Hey Arnold bobblehead. This is so cute. So the next thing I see is a Hey Arnold Gerald vase. So I'm gonna open this and see what this looks like. I think this is gonna be really cute. Oh my gosh, how fun funny is this so it is it's a little bitty vase you could probably put a couple of short stem roses or something in there that's super funny so the next thing that's in here is a vinyl collectible and it is a ninja turtle ice cream on a stick this is so cute if you guys have ever bought ice cream from an ice cream vendor like the vans that come around you know in your neighborhood with the music they actually sell these heads on sticks normally it's power rangers at least that's what it was when i was a kid i haven't bought ice cream in a really long time especially not from the vans but he even has the bubblegum eyes which is so cute because if you've ever had that it's always the like head on a stick with bubblegum eyes so this is absolutely adorable now this is obviously plastic but that is a super cute collectible the next thing that I pulled out is this Hey Arnold tumbler. This box is definitely Hey Arnold themed, which is so cute. I love that all of their boxes are usually one show specific. One of the first boxes that they ever sent out uh, that I do have is the Nick box that was Rugrats themed. To this day, that is probably still my favorite box, but this box is super cute as well. This is just a really cool Hey Arnold tumbler that has different scenes from the show on it. And if you guys are wondering, this is actually really good quality. It is a legit Nickelodeon tumbler. The next thing that I see is a Spike plush, and I cannot tell you how excited I am. If you guys watched Rugrats like I did, it was my favorite Nickelodeon show in the entire world. Oh my gosh, it is so adorable. As you can see, it's got the Rugrats tag here. He is absolutely perfect. Oh, so precious, so precious. I am like fingers crossed that they eventually send like a Tommy and Chucky plush in the box. I don't know if they will like ever do that, but I would kill to have all of the plushes from the Rugrats collection. I think that would be the cutest thing ever. This is the first Rugrat plush that I have. However, they did send the Cynthia doll out, um, the actual doll that like Angelica would play with from the movie. And by far, that is the favorite toy that I've gotten in any of the Nick boxes is the Cynthia doll because that is so limited edition. That's never been released before, but this is so cute. I'm super happy to have Spike. So the next thing that I'm seeing is a glove for your canned drinks, and that's pretty cute. On the back, it has a Rocco's Modern Life theme. Um, we did get a few Rocco Modern Life items in the last box, if you guys remember. I got the really big towel and stuff, so that's super cute. 
and then on the back it just says the knit box oh my gosh guys I am seriously freaking out right now this is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life can we please just take this in for a moment we have the Krabby Patty spatula from Spongebob and it's actually metal. This is not a plastic spatula. This is like a heavy duty spatula. I cannot believe this right now. This is so freaking cute. And we have a hat that goes on your head. It does have a clip on the bottom so you can clip it into your hair or bun. This is so adorable. I am blown away by this box. They seriously put so much effort into this. How freaking cute is this? Oh my goodness. And if you can see here on the spatula, it does say SpongeBob SquarePants, which, oh my goodness, adorable. The next thing we have are some Real Monsters chip clips. These are just plastic clips that you can put on your bag of chips. Um, I love that they always include other things in the box, even if it is a Rugrats box or whatever. They always include stuff from other shows, and this is just super cute. And it just goes to show how much effort they really do put into these items. And the last thing that I've pulled out, it looks like a beanbag toss game, which is super cute. It is two-sided, so they gave you two beanbag toss game. So what it is is it basically just has all of the characters from a lot of the 90s Nickelodeon things. We've got Ren and Stimpy, Thornberries, we have the Angry Beavers, we've got Rugrats. This is super cute. And the back also has all of the same characters, but it is just a different color. Okay guys, that is it for this Nick Box unboxing. My two favorite items from the box were definitely Spike the Plush Doll. I think that was the cutest idea, and I'm so happy that they included Rugrats stuff in this box. And my second favorite thing from this box was definitely the Krabby Patty spatula and the clip hat. I I mean, where are you going to find these items at? You know, they're so limited edition and they just really take me back to like a happier time. And I guess it's like my inner child coming out. I just love it. I love collecting stuff like this. I hope this video interests you guys. If you want to see more Nick Box unboxings, remember it's only once every three months, so it's not a whole lot, but I do enjoy opening them and sharing them with you guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Let me know. Comment down below. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in my next video. Be kind. Bye.